What's up guys, this is the Rifleman and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the United States. So the run happened last time, we successfully captured Istanbul and knocked the Ottoman Empire out of the game. And this has put us in a pretty interesting position. Um, because in Europe there are only three, well pretty much three nations. I'm just trying to get, there you go. So we have Norway, which is a minor, which is a protectorate of Sweden, which only has one region. The rest of which is Russia. Plus, just sneaking into Persia. Oh, and then we also have uh, the Prussians here on Sardinia and the Maltese. So what I'd like to do is not declare on, Mal on the, Ot on the uh, Prussians yet, because they are about to f construct fortifications in Gdansk, and that's quite a nice way to capture it. It's by assaulting a fort, and it's quite a handy battle when they've got lots of reinforcing armies like this. So I'm not going to be fighting the Prussians yet. Um, these guys will reinforce and then land on Sardinia to knock them out of the game because they are also building walls. And then these forces will then go on to hit Malta to knock the Maltese out of the game. So let's make ready, sure they are replenished. At the ready. Good, so let's get you... Well, there's a limit to what I can get you anyway because of the infrastructure of the island. Let's get you a howitzer. Good. The guy's actually inside the fort, you're replenishing too. Awesome. And so now we're at this position where we have to pick what we do carefully. So let's take this army, who was going to help here, pull him up, push him up to the border of Moldova. Same with this guy. Well, actually, I could just use my navy. Let's embark him. Ooh, that's not. Oh, that's ours. This oh, this is all ours. I see. In which case, then you're going to go up to this bridge. I thought for some reason we were just this. That this this stretch of land would be Russian, but it's ours. So when these guys get replenished, they're going to probably going to head to the high ground to the east. Can my Moldova garrison leave? Can to capture this high ground. This army is going to be here ready to slam straight into Warsaw. Oh, this is a lovely elite army. Let's embark you onto the ships. Let's take this fleet and send you. Potentially, potentially, I'll put you. Here's the best place to put you, I think. But I'd like to move these ships out. Let's put you into this port in Sinop. And let's take this army, because it's a very, very good elite army. What I'd like to do is actually send it up. Actually, you will be the army that will hit Kiev. You will probably head up to this section of high ground. You need to wait till they're ready. Plus, you need a bit of a bit of repairs done to yourself. This big army up here, you can go. You start working your way up here as well. Take you a few turns, but I'm not really rushing. Sir. You are also on the move. Good. Good. <coughs> and then let's move these. bunch these sepoys together, these native Indian infantry, and let's send them out over here as a bit of a reinforcement. So this army, you're just, re you're just reserves. Ready for order. So I want to move you onto this road. Impossible, sir. Ready to move up and threaten Armenia. Well actually no, you need to stay here. Ready if I move you onto this road to threaten Armenia, 
you so, block any emergent quick move south that these chaps may wish to do. Your job is just to hold. You are being replenished and we can recruit good infantry, so I might disband these two native units and replace you with howitzers. Then these three armies are here waiting for the call to cross over and hit Copenhagen. Your orders contract accepted. I have zero problems of trying to assassinate their their leaders. Oh, you're going back and on board. Forward. You're laying siege to Mexico. I think I'm going to take this army and send them up to start chopping up some of these loose armies up here. Although you're getting ready. ready. See where well, you're. Yeah, humbled. you get in. You get into the army. You're recruiting one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's go recruit one more thing. It's a unit of Marion's Rangers. Good. So that'll be one turn. That'll all be recruited and ready. Then they can move. Actually, they might go take out the Huron and Moose Factory. Then start the long walk to Yankton. Yeah, I think that's a good plan. It's a lot of mortars. Siege works. Underway. Oh, there's no point recruiting infantry. May as well just wait. Cool. So let's hit and turn. Oh, ah, that's that. There's the the uh, other unit that is that was recruited by that army. I do need to get more naval forces out to the Indian region. If you declare on me, Russia, I will... All my forces are ready to go, pretty much. It's going to be a bloody old fight it is to defeat the Russians. I want to move... Oh, I should have... So my army in Istanbul, they're going to head east to help support the fight um, on the Turkish border and up in the Caucasus. Once Istanbul stable, so it might be a few turn. This is kind of what starts to happen. Good, we made peace with the Persians, and now they are falling back. See, the Swedes are raiding, but I want them to pull back. Oh, there are naturally occurring resources in Gentlemen this region here. that are not currently being exploited. Development in these areas now. Guess I have no religion. No, no. Diggory Waller. Let's fight a duel. Sure, I never know which one's my guy. And one of them's going to run away, and it's probably going to be my guy. Don't be my guy. Don't be my guy. Please don't be my guy. I so rarely do duels. Damn it! He lost. Upgrade the mines. Sir. Mm, to be honest, I might just replenish you in port my for now. Man. Don't embark. March. You're still on the go. Try to keep assassinating Russian people because eventually they might just get fed up and declare war on me. Let's do some upgrades. Yes. No, I want no. I'll get this army to head over here to help to be ready to move. Whoa, they are going the complete wrong way. Fine. Up here you go. Probably here. Impossible. You're already on the move. To be honest, my Serbia garrison. Just 
go here and be ready to hit Sophia. And let's tax you. Kind of holds you back here. In case things go awry. So who do we have here? A couple of reinforcing armies, a nice big garrison. Level two forts. But I've got a heck load of troops. I probably want these guys to breach. Because I've got some good cannons, some good artillery. Not the most elite yes. breaches, so like these guys would be very good for that. Got the marines and the guards. But they've got no howitzers. Hmm. Now we're resupplied. Let's upgrade the church school. Keep converting the regions. You are not really doing anything, but you're down close to being useful. Let's get you... Un of Curiosiers. Two howitzers. Wherever they are. There they are. Two howitzers. And let's see if we can get anything slightly interesting. Uh, native mercenaries don't really excite me. Ooh, riflemen scouts. Let's get two of those. Cool. Then you'll be ready to do something useful. Yep, you're on the move. Everyone's on the move. Where's Kirch? Kirch is over here, isn't it? Yep. Break you down, because it's probably bumming you out. Oh, not so much. End turn. There we go. <clears throat> My armies are on the move. A massive strategic redeployment. Any further orders? We have ready, Russia. Do you want to try us? Uh, let's replace... The no, we don't need to have House on Cavalry in that army. Drop the howitzer in. Awaiting further orders. Sweet. I do not want Gibraltar, sir. No, wait, I'm not going to give up Gibraltar. Mm hmm. Writing's on the wall now, Russia. What are you going to do? So all those armies that are coming up, that will be going up through the north, through Sweden, they'll start to do amphibious operations off their coast just to try to draw some of their forces away. But holy moly, this is going to be a slog to beat the Russians. Oh, Polish rebels. And they now have no garrison in Warsaw, which is nice. Lots of armies in Finland. This is where my navy does need to be very strong to stop them from being able to break out. So maybe send some ships up around Norway. Ah, <laughs> oh, the Mexicans are sallying out, so we're definitely going to fight that. Do not want to attack, flood, and then I'm screwed. Real bad time. So let's get ready. This army needs to keep uh, maintaining its rate of advance up the coast. Well, up the up the continent, I should say. Just because they got all those mortars. I don't like mortars. There we go. Let's put this field artillery regiment here. With two more. Slaughter. Ooh, 
Maybe they'll find round shot. Maybe they'll creep it in range. See, look at all that. Can you imagine attacking all that? Oh, here come their rockets. Come on, you men. Abandon your guns. Yeah, my foot artillery is having some pot shots. There we go. All the gunners have quit. Delicious. Quick lime shot. Oh, poor dragones. Oh, poor, poor souls. And here comes all of the gunners and whatever little infantry they have. Let's do shrapnel shot. Ultimately, this isn't a battle battle, it's just going through the motions. Because these poor souls don't have a chance. I'm going to make the guns for a minute. Batarian pirates. Unfortunately, they're shooting at my infantry. <laughs> These guys are going to shoot. <laughs> Fair play if they get to my mortars. Close range artillery. Yeah, it's not a very good position for canister, but it's better than that than uh, shrapnel shell. get someone to climb up this thing. Come on, get you all to blow a hole on the side of it. slowly outside. Handy. It's nice of them to come slowly out the front. 
cool. Good old Sabcha for me, but I'll take it. There's plenty more battles to come, so I'm not maxing out of these smaller region ones. region that has not yet been developed. Select the type of port to construct here. A fishing port will help your population grow. A trade port will provide... Oh, yes, upgrade both these fishing fleets. So these guys are waiting for the assault on Norway and Sweden. Then they sort of resolve that. They will hate us. So is that your seminary? Let's just knock that down. Upgrade the plantation. Upgrade this. Upgrade the steam sugar mill. Destroy that and destroy this naval hospital. Don't need it. And let's get rid of your tax. And let's build some roads. Sounds like a good plan to me. Then let's take this army. Embark them on the ships. March. Send this battered navy to take the pirate region of Lower Louisiana. God alive, that's not even going to be it. Nope. See. Capture. Then when they're ready, move up and take Lower Louisiana and knock down the seminary. Upgrade, upgrade. Repair. And let's... Well, oh, you got good roads. Cast the first step of this bit, Dan. So then this guy... Firstly, go up and secure uh, Moose Factory, then move down and knock out the Huron Territory. How can I help? Sabotage their building. And oh, he got shot. Probably wasn't going R enough. So that's the Mexico faction knocked out the game. Let's go back to where, where the, the, real, the real strategy matters. Yes. One more turn till Gdansk has their walls. More than that. Have him again. <laughs> so pissed. Oh no. Have him. What? What? You! Right, that's it. Where's my rakes? Where are they? Where's my nearest rake? Trouble is, they're usually everywhere because I forget about them. So there's one up here. No, he's dead. Uh, lists, agents. Those all look like. America to me. Yep, they are. Damn. First rake I get, it's going to kill him. What's his name? Abraham, Abraham Gottlob Werner. You're what I'm after, you, Sonny. Okay, so they've got level 1 forts, and then they're going to go get level 2. So let's hit in turn. My forces are still on the move. Oh, oh yeah, you better run. No, it's a different one. There he is. I'm going to destroy your faction. You've killed my gentleman I have no need for. I'm going to destroy your home. think we all know who wins there. Ooh, okay, after Russia's mammoth end turn, there is unused lands because that was literally about 12 Building minutes, 15 here. minutes that they, their end turn capacity. took, and I'm Including not going to be doing that every time, so that's why I, I cut the part, and I will do it again. Good, replenish and get yourself some actual infantry for once. Sweet. 
And you let's go the religious building. Oh, I lost my general attacking his place, or he's just died. Sad, he was with me from the beginning, I think. You go up and take up Louisiana. Ooh, a rake in oh, New France, of course you would be. A gentleman in New Andalusia. Natural causes, Dennis Grant. He wasn't all the chap. Charles Hawthorne, eight to go. Cool. Let's keep going with the upgrades. Sweet. So now I think the time has come for an attack on. Where is it? Do I do attack the Prussians? Yeah, why not? It's a diplomacy. Prussia. They're not at war with anyone, but they don't like me. So let's declare war on the Prussians. Sir, humble so if sir. I move you here, Forward. March. I move sir. you here, Attack. it's going to be an almighty siege, but I think we're up to the task. But, well, yeah. Sure, it's basically judging by the timer, I can't remember what time we we're on. Um, let's just move you there. Good. Um, we're looking at a timer because I had to cut the the um, end turn. I don't quite know how long this part is, but I'm assuming this could be quite a big battle. So what I'm going to do is cut the part here and say thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for the Siege of Gdansk.